Hello guys, The Practitioner here again. I've just developed a new trick today based on an old theme, and you guys get to be the new test subjects for it before I put it to the rest of the public in my local area. So, here's what I want you to do for me. I want you to think of a number between 21 and 29. Have you got that number in mind? Good. I want you to add the digits together. So say, for example, if you had 22, you would have added 2 plus 2 equals 4. Now I want you to take the sum of the digits and subtract it from the original number. So in this particular case, again, had it been 22, it would have been 2 plus 2 is 4. 24 minus 4. You get my idea where I'm going with this, right? Okay, good. So now, have you done that subtraction? So you, again, remember, you've, you had to add the digits and subtract the sum of the digits from the original number. Okay, good. Now I want you to take that difference, the number you have now, and switch it for its corresponding letter in the alphabet. So say for example if you had arrived at 3 as being, your, um, as being the difference of between, the, uh, between the sum of the digits and the original number, uh, you would have picked C, you know, A equals 1, B equals 2, etc. I want, take your time, count through the alphabet in order to get to the um, number you are at, okay? Okay. Good. You should have had about enough time now to calculate it. Now that you have your letter, I want you to think of an, a vegetable. I want you to think of a vegetable starting with that letter. Okay? Good. Now move to the letter in the alphabet after that and think of an animal starting with that letter. Okay, good. I'm not going to try to read your mind for the vegetable and the animal. And again, remember, I did not know your original number, so there's no mathematical trickery I could have used to get this. Here we go. I keep seeing a radish being eaten by a snake. A radish eaten by a snake. Um, if I got that right, great. Uh, if not, post below. Um, again, this is a prototype. I think you all have figured out by now how I've done this trick. Um, try it on your friends. <laughs> I trust that your friends will be bad enough at math that they won't figure out how they did this, how I did this. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Um, stay tuned for my next trick, um, which is um, a magic trick purely for calculus students. Um, if you don't know calculus, uh, this trick will go like, what the hell was I just talking about? If you do know calculus, this trick will not be impressive. But I'm still going to just try it anyway. I just want to see if you can figure out how I do it or not. Uh, remember, math, uh, math groupies only for the next trick. See you around.